after having traveled to 78 countries and having spoken at the speaker in 32 of them, I have learned that there are so many people would love to achieve big, hairy and audacious goals, but only few really can. Why? Because there's a big difference between achieving short-term goals and achieving big long-term goals. Every one of us is a master on achieving short-term goals. We can easily cook a dinner, bring children to the school, arrange for the plumber, clean up the house, even write a blog post. Every one of us is the master on achieving short-term goals. However, when we are thinking about achieving big long-term goals, we fail. We want to study a foreign language. We want to get, in, get, get rid of the extra excess weight. We want to start and build a successful multi-million dollar company. But the strategies and tactics we used to apply for the achieving short-term goals never work for achieving long-term goals. The last 15 years, I have worked with the Russian-speaking clients and students worldwide. And I have developed a system for achieving big long-term goals. The system that helped me to create and grow multi-million dollar business with a clientele in over 70 countries. The system that helped me to write several uh, bestseller books. The system that helped me uh, getting rid of extra 60 pounds weight. The system that helped me start uh, open water swimming at the age of 44 and only in 10 months time to cross swim the Bosphorus from Asia to Europe. The system that guarantees that you can, regardless of your past experience, achieve what you always wanted to achieve. The system that many, that thousands of my clients are applying every day for the last years. And I have put a webinar together that I call The Art of Big Goals. This is a free webinar, and I will share this time-proven system with you. The only thing is required for you to register, and I will see you soon at the webinar. And I would love to share what I have learned and developed in the last 15 years. Please sign up, and I see you soon.